I've heard uh, that companies come, want to locate in Arkansas, and they ask for data about logging capacity, timber resources, uh, wages, uh, you know, worker supply, things like that. And we don't have that data. They'll go. We didn't have climate change. We're headed towards a point where starving bark beetles are going to enjoy our forests rather than humans building homes. We've got to do something. So the center will provide a lot of different services. Uh, First and foremost, we will be uh, providing support for uh, local communities and industries that are interested in exploring uh, the possibilities for sustainable forest development, and in other words, attracting new wood markets and, and wood processing industries. Uh, so it was a concept that they had developed uh, based upon what they saw was a need in the forestry industry, and also um, uh, a waste of materials in our forestry uh, industry where all of our materials were not being used. And so they had the idea of a center that could really study these concepts and look at the need, do research, and, and promote uh, the economic development of the state and the region based around that. Coincidentally, in the last 40 years, we've increased our forest density in the state by nearly 81%. Our trees are thicker, uh, they're older, uh, and they're more susceptible. We, we've really come to believe in this forest health concept that uh, the best way to keep our forests healthy is to keep them growing quickly. And so with the forest products industry and professional forest management and working with landowners, we've got a way to achieve these multiple goals. Southern forestry's thought it all along, but the whole nation is really rethinking the role of the forest, and it's a good time for us. This administration is climate, climate, climate. Having a really detailed analysis of the amount of timber that's out there in each major, in all the major regions of Arkansas is really essential for shoring up our existing businesses that depend on that, uh, that forest biomass as well as potential investors who would like to uh, bring new facilities into Arkansas. It's a lot of southern states that have a lot more emphasis on, on their economic research in their forestry departments than, than uh, Arkansas has. So that's one of the objectives is, is to um, you know, help, help develop that data that we can uh, increase the, the marketing of our forest products here in Arkansas. So in a way you could think of this as the vision statement for the Arkansas Center for Forest Business. And the first thing was to sustain healthy forest resources. That's our primary vision. And the second one is to support rural communities. Uh, and the third is to strengthen a green bioeconomy. So the Center for Forest Business is really a simple concept. We have healthy forests and a green forest industry producing products. And so we have an economic way to reduce forest density. And the center is really off to a strong start. Right now you can go to our website and see a listing for every county in Arkansas uh, what the amount of jobs and the amount of economic output is generated by forestry in that county. You can also see major uh, portions of the state and get a really in-depth analysis of the amount of timber volume that's out there. I think we haven't truly realized what the true potential of this center is going to be at this point, uh, even just with what we already know. Uh, we know that we have a wealth of forest products that are, are not being utilized in the state. It's like having a gold mine of resources and we're not using that resource. So this center, along with its researchers and its outreach, will find the ways that we'll use that existing wood product uh, to create new industry, uh, to create uh, new products that could be commercialized and to support existing business and industry as well.